Let me just very quickly introduce for the rest of them and so on in our panel today for the conversation with the Minister. We have got Sam Lee, Extreme to our right, our team leader in the company for more than 10 years, Nizam, my brother, and as well as your good hearted NC all the while, and it's also our team leader, Mr. Lim Yong Hock, KEO of the company whose neck is always on the chopping board for all regulatory requirements, key executive officer under this council of estate agencies. We have Calvin Fong, who is the biggest team leader with close to 2,000 salespeople under this network. And finally, Sazami, who has been with us for the last 14 years, the largest and the biggest Malay Muslim real estate team in the company. There has been a lot of concern and particular financial services impact on manufacturing on every aspect. And uh, so it is always important to ensure that the, there is a certain prudence in the banking sector, that they are not overexposed, no choice. And uh, at the same time, we also need to make sure that people are not overgeared. And you want to do it in a way that doesn't bring down people's uh, livelihood, it doesn't crash the market, because crashing the market is not in anybody's interest. So if you look at it from OE onwards, we were watching very carefully. Thankfully, we had been prudent, and MAS had exercised a sufficient degree of prudence over our banks, but we were still concerned that the amount, two things, that the amount of borrowing that people had not just the property, but general borrowing. Second, the amount of borrowing that people had towards the property sector. And third, the amount of exposure that banks had. We were concerned about that. We were also concerned that there was a, a fairly significant uh, rise up in the prices of properties, which we didn't think was going to be sustainable. If it kept going on that way, all of you here, every single one of you, and all other real estate agents, for a short while it will be good, but in the longer term it will be bad, because it's not sustainable. It's better to make sure the market is sustainable. So for these reasons, and when the economy, our external trade and external economy is three and a half times our internal economy, which means every one dollar of impact outside has a multiplier effect inside. And we were impacted by the global economy, so 09, uh, 010, now the world economy is coming out. We put in measures in Singapore to try and make sure that we were okay. And we were basically through the great financial crisis, we survived.